Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I am gonna show how to make logo animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So for example, I will use this logo user file. Let's select this and move it inside our composition. And press S, change scale like this and let's create new background right mouse new and solid add name background and click ok move to behind logo file and go to fx presets search fx fill select this fill let's use for this background and change color like this click ok and lock layer then go to shape layers hold this icon and select this ellipse tool let's hold shift make one ellipse click selection tool and chain stroke with zero go to fill and let's select this eyedrop select this black color click ok click selection tool and let's move to center like this and go to window if you not see this part go to window and enable a link and click this icon and this icon for move the object center and press P let's select this logo and hide layer select the shape layer press P and select the shape layer and go to pan behind let's hold control double click for move anchor point center click selection tool and make new passing keyframe let's move to down Okay, and go to 10 keyframe for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down in the keyboard and let's move to up like this again go to 10 keyframe move to down again 10 keyframe move to up and again move to down and finally again and click this like this okay let's see nice and let's go to 10 keyframe and move to down so let's select your frames make easy list animation okay nice select these last six j frames hold alt move to right nice and let's move to right like this so let's select the shape layer and hold shift press s click this icon and go to here Let's make scale shape frame, change scale like this and like this. Let's move to left and in this time change scale this 100 and change this. Let's try like this 85 and go to here change 100 say keyframes make easy let's see nice and go to here and in this time select the shape layer let's change name object 1 and ctrl d for duplicate press u and select all keyframes and delay it and let's select this object 2 press p make new passing keyframe and let's move to here and go to here make new passing keyframe for object one and go to 10 keyframe let's move to right this and select this move to left let's go to here click this and enable title action save okay and let's move to right this and let's enable this grid let's disable okay and move to left and this okay say so keyframes make easy let's see okay so go to here let's cut this layer let's see nice and in this time go to 10 keyframe and select this keyframe ctrl c ctrl v and 
select this layer object one select first key frame control c control v let's see okay so select key frames go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph select this let's move to left and select this move to right let's see okay back to chain frames and select these last three chain frames hold alt move to right let's see nice okay and in this time let's hold shift press s make sketch frames and go to here let's change scale like this let's change 140 and this let's move to left and here change 100 and select key frames make easy let's see okay and here make new scale key frames again go to here change scale like this and go to here change 100 let's see okay nice so in this time let's select this logo enable and let's move to right and press p make new passing chain frame hold shift press s chain scale like this let's move to down and make scale chain frame go to 10 chain frame let's move to up and click this icon chain scale okay let's try change like this and go to here let's move to down and chain scale like this Let's change 20 and this 20. Say chain frames make easy. And go to here. Let's close this and uh, let's see. Okay, say chain frames. Go to graph editor and let's select this graph. Let's move to left and this make like this. nice and go to here let's select this last chain frame move to down go to 10 chain frame move to up again go 10 chain frame move to down again move to up let's see okay select chain frames and select this last four chain frames hold alt move to right nice so let's select this logo and move to left okay let's move to right nice and in this style select this object one and object two go to edit and split layer and delete let's see nice and select this logo object one and object two let's click this for motion blur and let's see again nice and let's see here let's press n okay that's good so in this time let's add some details let's go to window and open animation comes 3 if you not have animation comes 3 you can watch my video and you can learn how to download and how to install animation comes 3 it's free and let's open starter precoms and shape elements and I want to use these fireworks let's click and add 
Okay, let's see. Okay, let's move to left. And let's change colors. Let's color one yellow. And color two black. And again yellow. And black. And again yellow and black. Okay, let's close animation composer and let's see. Let's move to right and move to behind. Okay, let's see. Nice. So, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.